Well, I already know where some people are going to go with this, but listen. I have faith in the Philadelphia Eagles. Now, this morning I was sitting in my bed and I was like, man, I can't believe the Eagles are going to be in the playoffs. But when you think about who they're playing, the GOAT, Tom Brady, and Tampa, and you look at the conditions, the weather conditions, you look and you say, there's some hope. Maybe Philadelphia uses the the ground game. And I think that this game is going to be close, right? Look at the last time we played Tampa. Tampa took their foot off the gas. It was 28 to seven, but then Tampa took the foot off the gas and it came to 22 and 28. And had there not been an egregiously awful taunting penalty, maybe Philadelphia gets a stop, but I don't think they win that. But The fact that some people are trying to say that this is the same Philadelphia team, that this is the same team from before, is is weird to me. Because they're two different offenses, right? Philadelphia has a way more committed run offense versus the last time in week six where Sirianni was so hard-headed he kept wanting Jalen to throw it down the, the field like 30, 40 times, and you can't win with that. And eventually... These coaches self-scouted, and they said, let's run the ball. And look what happened. And sure, they've played some inferior teams, yes. And sure, they're, they've only beaten one team with the winning record, the Saints. Still, this team has developed, right? And it's not it's not Philadelphia that chose the schedule. It was the NFL, right? And But Philadelphia needed someone to improve with, right? They were playing NFL teams. Granted, they were pretty inferior. They're pretty bad now that we see them. But I, I think Philadelphia has a shot here. And I think Philadelphia has a chance to upset. It's going to be close, right? Jalen's going to be running down the field at least 20, 30 times. Boston Scott, Miles Sanders is coming back, right? This Philadelphia offense has the keys to win. They can run the ball. They can run on the outside. They're not going in the center. They're not going to try to take on Vita Vea, which got a contract extension. No. They are going to try to make holes on the outside and get 5 to 10 yards and extend drives. Because when you're playing when you're playing Tom Brady, when you're playing Tampa, you don't want Tom Brady on the field because he will score. And it doesn't even matter who is on the field with Tom Brady. Tom Brady will literally try to throw it with the janitor. He will try to throw it with the scrub that's in the stadium. He will literally use anything to throw to. Because that's what Tom Brady did. Remember when uh, we saw it in the NFC Championship game? He took Scotty Miller, came in off the streets, and guess what happened? Scotty Miller got a clutch touchdown in that game against the Packers. And granted, this is not going to be easy for the Eagles. This will all come down to Philadelphia's defense. This will all come down to what Jonathan Gannon will do. Will he play aggressive? Will he play up? Will he stick it to the Buccaneers? Or will Jonathan Gannon do like he normally does and play Ben Don't Break, which will then torch him? Either way, I am excited for this game. What about you? Let me know in the comment section down below. And if you like this, make sure to like and subscribe. Until next time, I'm Andrew Michael, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Fly, Eagles, fly. Kaka, kaka.